Hi guys, it's Amy from Now Polish Baby 90 and welcome to today's video. Today I'm here with a swatch and review of a brand new, brand spanking new indie brand and I'm really excited. I love showing indie companies, I love working with new companies and the one that I'm going to show you today is literally brand new. This is the first collection coming out from them. I'm really excited. So the brand is Splattered Paint Lacquer and this has been made by Angie and Angie lives in Canada. So an international brand for you guys. I'm just going to do a little close up here on what the labels look like. So like I say, Splattered Paint Lacquer. They are a brand that is 7 free and all of the bottles here have 11 mil in them. This collection that she's releasing to start with is a four piece, almost dropped one, a four piece spring collection and we're going to go through and swatch them today. So if you want to see this new indie brand, just keep watching. So seeing I'm just showing you this one a little bit, this one is called Fresh Grass and it's a beautiful grass green. I would say it's got a couple of drops of lime into it and there is a little bit of a, I don't know, like a little bit of a silvery shimmer to it. They're not very strong, just something that makes it not a standard cream finish. Um, this one for me was opaque in two or three. There were some nails that needed three, some that needed two, but it's just a really nice lime green colour and like I say a little bit of a, a shimmeriness to it as well. Um, so that first one there was Fresh Grass. Next up we have a Crelly and this is called Little Bunny Poo Poo and this is a beautiful, well I thought this was more of a chocolatey base when I looked at it, like more like a coffee chocolatey base, but actually on my nails it almost looked like a mannequin hands kind of look and in there that we have some holographic um, large circle glitters. So we have aqua, aqua teal, we have um, a fuchsia of uh, purple, and we have gold and silver. And like I say, they are nice and round. So to me, it almost looked like a Smarties Easter egg. I think Smarties are maybe just a UK thing. But like this chocolatey base with these round glitters in here, I definitely haven't seen anything like that before. It does take three coats to be completely opaque, and you will want to top coat it, just so some of the glitters where they are a little bit larger will sit the base will sink down and they will be a little bit raised so you're going to get a nice amount of glitters I didn't set this upside down or anything and you can see hopefully from the swatch that I did get a nice variety and size and range of glitters on my nails so that one was three coats of little bunny poo poo the third one is called spring thaw as in everything's thawing out not the marvel superhero thaw just to clarify. This is a beautiful like a denim, like a bluey grey colour and it is jam packed with glitters. It's mainly um, white glitters and then gold holographic glitters in here and they're a variety of sizes. There's nothing too too large in there but like I say it's a mixture from very small um, all the way up to kind of like a medium size glitter in here. A really nice crelly like the other one. When it builds up you can see through the jelly and you can see the glitters on the first couple of coats you've put down. So I did three coats of this. I just think it suited the name so beautifully. You can see this as like something thawing out for definite. So that one was three coats of Spring Thaw. And the last one, which was my favourite, is called Sunshine. And this is a beautiful yellow with a red flash to it. I've never seen anything like this. When they arrived, I was like, oh my goodness, like, what is this? And I think I've spoken to a few of my, like, now polished friends about this already. I'm like, this yellow, yellow with red? Like, I honestly haven't seen anything like this. Did I say it was called Shut Sunshine? I hope so. And um, like I say, yellow with red. This got completely opaque in three, which is really nice formula for a yellow. I was very happy with how it looked on three coats. Most yellows are hard to apply, but this one was pretty good for what it was, and the shimmer stood out very nicely, and it was a very obvious shimmer. Hopefully the photos are going to be doing it justice, and yeah, something really different. So three coats of sunshine. So that was quite nice and short and sweet, the four polishes from the um, opening collection by Splattered Paint Lacquer. So the prices do um, vary, um, some of them are more expensive than others, so I will link the website down below for you so you can convert it into your own currency because they range between being 11 down to 8 Canadian dollars and obviously you need to just then convert them into wherever you are in the world or if you're from Canada that's how much they cost. You can also do these in a bundle deal for 35 Canadian dollars where you get all four of them. Now I said to Angie what do you want me to tell everybody and she said just give my own opinion which I've done so the only thing she really wanted me to let you know is obviously that they were 11 mil, 7 free, I've told you the information it will be linked down below and if at any point these do sell out she plans on keeping her first few collections in stock so there's a bit of an inventory like on her Etsy site so I'm going to say everything 
things down below for you. Let me know what you think of these down below. I'm personally always excited to see new indies. You can't get enough of indies in my opinion. And thank you so much to Angie for allowing me to show her debut collection. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye.